Following a visit and tour of the Sheldon Kennedy Child Advocacy Center in Calgary, Mayor Ted Clungston and Police Chief Andy McGrogan agree something like it is needed here in Medicine Hat. And now they've started talks to get the ball rolling. We put together a group, I think there's about, last time I was there, about 10 to 15 people in the room that uh, from various uh, disciplines that are trying to move this forward and trying to do be a do committee and not a talk committee. Police deal with an average of 30 child sexual assault cases annually and they've said before they believe there are likely hundreds of incidents that go unreported every year. Mayor Ted Clugston says a center like this may encourage more victims and their families to come forward. People are talking about it more now than they ever have been and recognizing it and family members can recognize it that maybe have something is going on or, or even so I think the, the incident report rate will go up and especially if we have a center. The Child Advocacy Center in Calgary helps child and youth victims of sexual crimes get access to supports and services they need. It brings together police, Alberta Health Services, counselors and even prosecutors under one roof. A child advocacy center Center here would be a much smaller version of the one in Calgary and would be funded through many different forms. There's probably some some dollars from the, the provincial, uh, of course, um, these are provincial initiatives, most of them, but be it AHS or child welfare and that kind of thing, um, and education. So hopefully we can maybe move something like this forward. Plans for a child advocacy center here in Medicine Hat are still in their infancy and need a lot of work and partnerships in order to get it off the ground. But Mayor Clugston says he is confident that stakeholders in the community will step up and help ensure that it gets built in the future. Leah Murray, Chat News.